All right, guys, welcome back to another edition of The Timmy Show. And tonight we got a couple of uh, breaks. Um, we got um, Channel Fireball. And then we have uh, Cards with Michael that is back. And uh, let's do Cards with Michael first. It's been a long time. And uh, since we've done Cards with Michael... And I'm kind of eager to get back to that. I miss them a lot. And uh, hopefully it's gone back well. Um, okay. We did a lot of um, Modern Horizons 2, I remember. Because uh, Modern Horizons 2 is one of my big sets I love. Because it brings back fetch lands. And I'm a real big fetch lands person. And uh, none of this has fetch lands in it. So, cool. Uh, wait, we do got some. Okay. Let's go back here. It does have sleeves. So we do have a grief. I'm gonna pull some of those out. We ha we have a grief. A narcomancy. That's like a ten dollar card. Back. Hey, and we got a. We got a. Misty rainforest. You gotta see that. Okay. I'm gonna open this up because we need some more. We're gonna need some more sleeves. We got a verdant catacombs foil. That is beautiful, beautiful. I mean, you're not gonna live that down, so we're gonna pack that up. Come on. Vernon Catacombs. Then we got wait two cords in this. Well, that's not as good as a a solitude. Solitude is another big hit. I'm gonna tell you something. In cords with Michael, Michael might have not known. All these came out of one pack. So ignoble hierarch. Solitude and the Verdant Catacombs all came out, out of one pack. That is like an $80 pack that it, they came out of. And I'll, I'll put that in that. Uh, might not even put it in that section. They go there. That's fine. And then we're going to go through the rest of the cards. I don't believe any of the rest of the cards are anything more. Oh, well, we do have this. Okay, that's a rare. Binding Gill. Earth. Weave Earth. Okay. Foily Bramble Spark. I'll put that there. And we got a Ice Quake and that. Okay. Then we go back to Magic. And we got a those two that's fine I'm gonna pull out all the rares and mythics that we got okay foil land that's fine anything of value from these because I do like these card breaks so my cards with Michael channel fireball I do love doing those a lot. And then I do love um, a few others. That's a beautiful, that's a beautiful island, I want to say. So, all right, we got a weaver and a foil. Oh, that's nice too. Look at that. A foil. 
Well, not a foil, but it, a. Ugh. Okay, that that is a foil, but that's a signed art card. Really, I, I love to see them signed by the person in general, but like, okay, cool, you know. But Gahada, like, that's a nice one. The coin is Walker Gahada. All right, let's go. All right, we got a foil burgeoning. That's fine. We got a foil snapshot and a flash. Okay. Foil frost fame. And a lightning press and a mark and a foil chilling. And that, okay. Yeah, we got a lot of stuff on this. Okay. A foil havens claws. Okay. Hey, we got a winner's well. That's a nice one. Sudcliffe, okay. Winner's Will, not in a sleeve. Really crazy, okay. I see encounter foil and yeah. Evergreen and a deep blue. Okay. okay. I'm trying to get all this out of here. Two rares. Okay. And a buzz bolt. I do love Tales of Aria. And uh, I got a lot of things coming forward with that. Um, and that's a winter's grass. Okay. I do have a cord and grating. Not from Tales of Aria, but from a break. <coughs> and it's one of the, the first cords that I've had that's going to be graded. And it's a I don't want to say. I'll tell you when we start getting cards closer to it, which is close. It's within the next week. Oops. Sorry on that. Embodiment. Okay. And a foil ball lightning that got banned. And constructed play. And blitz and the other. Because uh, it's just a good card. So. Alright. We're almost done with this. We'll go to the channel fireball section. Um, that's a foil. I'll put that there. That's fine. Arc Amoeba. Yeah, because they didn't even have the uh, foil art card in there. So that's fine. Ooh, wait. We got an icy storm and an reckoning. Neither one of those in sleeves. Wow. Oh, I'm sorry, Michael. We should put those in sleeves, sir. Um, two foil. I mean two rares and a foil. Like, yeah, um, if it's a majestic, we should definitely put it in a sleeve. Heaven's class again. I mean, that's just my sentiment on it. Like, um, if it's a Majestic, especially first edition, you put it in the sleeve, sir. You really do that. All right. We've got a rare. And two rares at the end. Okay. We're going to put these out of bounds because we do got some magic in there with it. But, um, and this is some, um, 
rears and stuff so but these are your majestics you got a winter's well an ice storm and an awakening so we're going to put that up there and uh we do got that so we're going to go on to our our channel fireball box break and we got some more of these coming and um I, I'm not going to lie. I do love Channel Fireball in their box breaks. Okay. Did it not go through? Okay. Maybe not. Maybe not. Okay. There we go. I'm unsure what this is. Is this anything? Okay. Maybe it is. Does have something in here? What is it? What is this? Oh, that's actually something good. So we'll put that up there. We'll put that up there. And we got this big break. And we got some dice. We're not worried about the dice. Oops, it's not cutting through. Why is it not? No, there we go. Okay, it's got some brakes. It's got a, It's got some. Okay, it's got some sleeves, some brakes. Okay, but this in particular, I'm, I'm looking at. I just got one spicy card to begin with. That's a really good spicy hit. Endurance and hey, another verdant catacombs. So that goes along with our other ones that are really great hits. So we got an endurance, a verdant catacombs, a solitude, a foil verdant catacombs, and a misty rainforest. So we got all those. We'll put those aside. All right, we're gonna. Whoops, what is this? Oh, it is a, okay, it is a Hobgoblin pre-release card. So that's cool. We'll put that aside. We're going to go on this. This is, um, looks like just, foilness? Want to say okay, that's foil too. Oh, those are rares. Okay, blackout kick that. Okay, foil common. That's fine. Blackout cut kick again. I guess they posted a lot of the. foils and stuff ahead of time and that's fine I see some sleeves coming up so maybe those are some majestics and stuff I don't know and if it's one of the cards we gotta send it back cause uh, we already put in the order to get it greeted I'm not gonna say what we're getting greeted just yet cause they just came out with the PCG grading on cards but, like, if I open one up and I want it graded, I'm going to get it graded. That's for sure. I'm glad they added that to the Channel Fireball menu. Okay, here we go. We got a Hardened Cross Trap and a Blood Rush Bellow. That's a Majestic, and that's fine. This is a Foil Common. And that's fine as well. That's all cool. Thank you. We move on. And we're going to get into some other stuff. And this is rares. A foil rare. And yeah, it's back on. It's back on the. 
back on the train of Tales of Aria, which we have a lot of this stuff already, and we got a lot of cool foils from Aria. I love opening it because it's it's been cheap. Hopefully, Everfest is is it's advertised cheaper than Aria was. Hopefully, it stays that way because I think Everfest is like eighty nine ninety nine. Hopefully it stays that way because I heard there's going to be some reprints of other cards. And hopefully it stays that way. There's a lot of cards in here. And we're going to go ugh, over all of them. If I can get this daggum boy. Oh, oh, that's from the other side. I'm taking, I'm opening it from the proper side it was in. Um... Seek and Destroy, and Light It Up. Ooh, Majestic Foil. So we're going to put those in over there. Turn Timber. It's putting a lot of the stuff up front. Put those over there. And I think the rest of it is just going to be commons, uncommon, or commons, non-foils. And that's the case. Then we'll move forward with what we got. So it's nice that they do that. Embodiment. Okay. Yep. Put that four. We. All right. We still got a whole box of stuff to go. All right. Here we go. A channel and a. Ooh, a foil blizzard majestic. That's very very nice. Um, we don't need that. There's the two foils. Weave Lightning and Rights. And another Rights and a foil Biting Gale. Strength and a Weave Ice. A Cold Wave. Okay. Put those there. Yep. And the rest, I do believe, are just going to be commons. No foils. Okay. Yep. Now we're back into other pool. Um. Foil four. Uh, yeah. A dungeon. We got another foil. Tome circle. Hey! This is one that I was wanting to get. Tiamat. So we got a Tiamat. And this is going to be, this is going to take place in my Dragon's deck. So, love everything about this card. I didn't know it was coming in this shipment. But it is a Tiamat. And uh, this is going to be the lead of my Commander deck. And uh, so grateful to see it. And uh, this is a, not a, um crazy this is not a um circle of dreams druid promo card but actually the full version of the ex extended foil of it which is really nice um and then i got the foil autograph of that that's nice so i'm gonna say i can't and these, I can't, can't say enough about. I'm going to put those there. Yeah. I mean, these are really nice. Rares and uncommons. I'm not big into uh, AFR. I, a foil portable hole, which a lot of people like. I'm not really big into AFR cards. They just weren't up my alley. I'm not big into D&D &D and stuff, even though I got a Stranger Things bundle. Those weren't up my alley, so. Um, we got an instrument board. I'll take that. I'm gonna go through these, because these are also we, Channel Fireball was selling the pre-release decks for like um, for 
$15 a pre-release deck, and that's very, very awesome. Very, very cool. Very, very affordable. And anytime you could buy a Magic the Gathering pack for $2.50 a pack, get it. But to be honest, I was not going to buy a lot of that stuff because um, I was just in it for the TM app. Um, that's the only card I needed because it's one of my EDH cards needed for dragons, five color dragons. And um, that wound up being really, really awesome and cool. Cleric, Fry. Ooh, that's a, that is a rare. And this is actually a cool one because this is actually a, I'm going to put that there in the foil section because I like that one. And so this is a really cool one because it's it's an aristocrat card and um, that's very very nice to have. Uh, flump. Nobody likes a flump. We we have a shit ton of cards here, man, and uh, I love every bit of it. Like I love going through this stuff. And there's a foil glimpse that I'm looking at. And there's a regular glimpse. Get that out of the way. An ornithopter and a foil glimpse and a crab. This is crazy, the value in this stuff. Here's a re. Yep. Karmic Guide. Yep. We're getting closer. We'll go ahead and add those to hand moderation is in there greed the greed is okay could go with mono black like mono black rats like I have because I have a mono blacks relentless de deck um, so that would be nice to add in there um this is what I don't like to see. I don't like to see list cards that are commons that were not even playable commons in in that set. That's not that's not cool. And then they have it in this set, like, oh, it's it's a really good set that it hey a necrogoif. Okay. Blacksmith, yeah. We got a ooze and not much else. Um, yeah, nope, nope. A deadly dispute, which is good. Road class, treasure vault, darkness. Yeah, there we go. A cabal coffers and a sky clay. That's nice. Those are all nice cards. And uh, I think that's going to be, well, it's probably going to come to an end on our stuff. Because I don't think anything else is worth a lot. But we got some great hits. Like, there's no doubt on the Mythics and the lands we got. And I want to say right now, like, I think Cabal Coffers is one that should be in the top loader. Almost to the end. So that was two. So after our second kit, we were able to get a Tiamat. And I think that that should be a sleeve too. The Evolving Wilds like that, I think is a really great kit. Anytime you can get an Altar type fetch land, you know, even at a common, like it's it's a very good card to get. What we got? Temple of the Queen. I think that's a good get too. And this in this card, yeah. I think that's a really good get. Alright. So 
So this is our really big hits we got. Tiamat, Endurance, Verdant Catacombs, Solitude, a Foil of Verdant Catacombs, and a Misty Rainforest. So I think that was all of our big hits. And then we got a lot of this stuff too. So I think Cabal Coffers is a big hit for us. And I see this card more pulled for AFR than any other card. And uh, I think we got a lot of big hits. That's a really big hit, dude. I think that's like a $15 card, if not more. But, yep. Yeah. Alright, guys. We're going to call it a night for that. And we got the two pre-release promos for that stuff. We're going to call it a night. You guys take care, and we'll see y'all later. Night-night.